guys, we have something truly exciting today. The highest end toy you will probably ever see on this channel. Heck, it's not even much of a toy. It's a high-end piece of art that's poseable. That is, of course, this. The Hot Toys Star Wars Ahsoka Tano. Jumping straight off the screen from Season 7 of The Clone Wars. I am so excited to share this with you guys today. So let's take a look at the box. First, we have Ahsoka, a picture of the figure on it. Below, another image of the figure. We spin the box. Yet another different pose of that Ahsoka Tano action figure. And then on the back, all the necessary legalese that you could ever want wherever this collectible is sold. This, of course, comes from their television masterpiece series. But enough about the packaging. Let's get to the action figure that I'll tell you isn't inside and all of her accessories. And here is Ahsoka herself with all her extra goodies. And what better place to start than there on her hips are her two lightsabers. As you can see, we have the Shoto and the regular lightsaber. She comes with a plethora of extra hands, including a gripping hand on each side for her lightsaber. Does a pretty good job of holding them. Very soft. Wonderful. And of course, a fist in case you have to give Maul a quick wallop across the face. And on the other side, another grippy hand and another force effect hand. Also allows you to hold the lightsaber while doing the force effect, so that's pretty cool. Then we have a few different lightsaber blades to choose from. Starting with this, the main lightsaber blade, and of course a smaller lightsaber blade for the Shoto. But that's not all. We also have these action lightsaber blades, both for the main lightsaber and of course that Shoto again. Then we do also have this holographic projector so she can communicate with members of the Jedi Order, starting with Anakin Skywalker, seen here in a translucent blue visage. Also, you can't forget Yoda, the Jedi Master, and of course, the star of the upcoming Disney Plus show, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Next, we have this thermal detonator. The action figure also includes a little bag of extra bits for her hips and knobs for her lightsabers when they are not hanging from her sides. Also, I forgot to put it here, but she does come with a cloak. You'll see that later. But next, we have this action stick is what we'll call it. What its intended purpose for, you will see a little bit later in this video. And it's a warning, it's not for the faint of heart. Before we get to her final accessory, I just want to point out, this high-end figure, the belt is disconnected on it. I think it was supposed to be glued in place, and it just didn't stick. But she does come with this nice stand. Her name's right on the front, as well as Star Wars. The figure does incorporate a beautiful, seamless joint system. But the price of not having to see a cut at her elbow is that she has to stay in a neutral pose when not being posed for toy photography or showing off to your friends. But how about we take a look at her articulation? Alright guys, it's time for Ahsoka to bust a move. Starting with her head, you'll see her tendrils here on the front and back really limit the movement at the ball joint. But that's to be expected. There are some limitations with this style of figure, and we'll break them down. Arms go most of the way up, and to the side, about 90 degrees. At the elbow, we are limited to 110 degrees of motion, not quite 90. But again, it's that seamless joint system, and you want to limit the motion to prevent any damage to that rubber finish on the arms. Moving on, we go down to the wrists, they spin, uh, they pop off, <laughs> they do have a little bit of a back and forward motion, but like many things of this figure, limited by its costume, so let's pop that hand back on, move now to the abs, where there does seem to be a crunch, she goes a little bit forward, a little bit back, but again that costume 
in so many different areas will cause limitations. Leg goes so far forward, skirt's in the way. So far back, again, limited by our skirt. The knee appears to be double-jointed, and she can, in fact, kick her own butt. Finally, let's move down to the ankle. It goes back, it goes a little bit forward, does have some spin, but the boot is going to limit that movement at the ankle. A reoccurring theme. But there is one final bit of articulation to this figure that you just have to see to believe. Now, with Ahsoka's head detached from her body, we can remove her face, which is sat inside with only magnets, holding it in place. As you can see, as we spin around, there are two little indentations inside. We can insert the action stick accessory we saw earlier in the video and use it to manipulate the position of Ahsoka's eyes. They are individually addressable, and boy, let me tell you, I'm terrified of leaving her cross-eyed. But with both eyes set, as you can see here now turned, we can reinstall this face after, of course, resetting her eye position to something a little bit more neutral for me, into her head and get the figure reassembled. Instead of making you watch me struggle to reassemble this figure using the power of video editing, let's cut now to some different poses of Ahsoka and my final thoughts. So ultimately, with this Hot Toys Ahsoka Tano, the thing you are probably asking is should I buy this toy? And I confidently can say no. This toy is beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's $250. I only think you should buy a hot toy if it's a character you love, if it's part of a collection of just beautiful action figures and if you have the disposable cash but if you do not stick to the black series the vintage collection and other figures you're used to in the words of tlc don't go chasing waterfalls but all said and done do i regret buying this figure absolutely not she's gorgeous and I am beyond excited to add this toy to my collection of other Ahsoka action figures. And I'm excited that you, my dozen upon dozen viewers, took the time to watch this video. I'm Chris. This is Shiny Plastic People. I hope you have a wonderful day. <laughs>